Partners, welcome to PBM's Video Entertainment, and welcome back to another episode of VeggieTales Home Media Reviews. In this video, we're going to be talking about the very first VeggieTales Western Bible story, and I'm of course talking about the Ballad of Little Joe. So, without further ado, let's jump into the history of the Ballad of Little Joe. So, the Ballad of Little Joe was originally released back in August 5th of 2003 on VHS and DVD. The original mass market distributor was Warner Home Video, and the original Christian market distributor was Word Entertainment. Then, October 5th of 2004, Sony Wonder re released Battle of Little Joe, I think for both VHS and DVD, I believe. And then, January 29th of 2008, it was re released by Word Entertainment. Then, January 24th of 2012, it was re released by Vivendi Entertainment. And then October 16th of 2018, it was re-released by Universal Studios. And now we got the history part done, we will now jump into my copies of The Battle of Old Joe. Alrighty, we will now jump into my copies of The Battle of Old Joe. So, we're going to start with the VHS copy, and the version I have of the VHS copy is the Warner Home Video copy from 2003. So on the top, here we have Big Idea Presents, Veggie Tales. Bavel Joe title card, and here we have Larry as Little Joe, Man Blueberry as Miss Kitty, then here we have Sheriff Bob, and then here we have Jean Claude as Jude, and then Philippe. I don't remember. I don't remember what character Philippe played in the in the story of Bavel Joe, but yeah. Over here it says a lesson in facing hardship. Spine Warner Home Video logo. Scrolling down here, here we have. Kirk Buffalo, Little Joe, Big Idea logo at the bottom, and then same thing on this spine, here at the top, and the back side, Sunday morning value, Saturday morning fun, blurb if you want to pause and read all of this, scenes from, from the episode, also includes Belly Button, the all new Silly Songs with Larry features the harmonic talents of the next great boy band, Boys in the Sing. Big A logo, and then here we have Warner Bros. Home Video, WEA, and here's the tape. Print date says July 11th, 2003. Last but not least, here we have the DVD copy, also distributed by Warner Home Video. So here we have the front poster, basically exactly the same thing except it's DVD size. And yeah, this is used. You could tell someone, I guess, loved this copy. <laughs> A little too much, I guess, or, or like you know, like um, like I guess when you're a kid, like um, you write down the name so that way you'll know this is you know your property or something like that. Anyways, here's the front spine. This time we have the big idea logo up top, and the Warner Bros logo is at the bottom. Then the back, Sunday morning value, Saturday morning fun, and then here we have the bonus features. Rated G in Canada, DVDs Region 1, yeah. And here's the disc. No pamphlet or anything, but that's okay. Anyways, we will now jump into the menu tour for The Ballad of Little Joe. Alrighty, here we have the menu tour for The Ballad of Little Joe. So here we have play, chapters, features, fun, and settings. Let's go to chapters, like we always do. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight scenes to choose from. For our features, here we have audio commentary, behind the scenes, how to draw Little Joe, and how to draw Meg Potiphar. And we have the art gallery, regression rails, previews. Let's have a look at that real quick. So here we have Jonah, Easter Carol, Snoodle's Tail. Three Twin Penguins, and yeah, same thing just like with Wonderful World of Entertainment, and same thing goes for the Larry Boy collection, right? Yep. 
And for VeggieTales Classics, um, so, um, here we get, like, um, another preview. So anyways, here we have Toys at Christmas, Rack Shack and Benny, Madden Blueberry, Josh and the Big Wall, King George, and Esther. And then, if we can go back to the main menu, go to the fun stuff. So, here we have Trivia Challenge, Storybook, which happens to be Bob Lends a Helping Hand. And then Sing Along, Tummy Ache Dreams, Family Fun Activity, and DVD ROM Fun. And then for our settings, here we have for audio 2.0 stereo or 5.1 digital saran. And English subtitles, you can switch them on or off. And that's it for the menu tour for the Battle of Old Joe. Now we'll jump into my review and thoughts on the Battle, the Battle of Old Joe. So overall, do I recommend the Battle of Old Joe? I gotta say, um, this this is a really good episode, if I'm be honest. Like, um, I like how it retells the story from Joseph in the Bible, but they did it in a Western kind of way, which I find that really fun and entertaining, if I'll be, if I'm be honest, you know. And yeah, I think out of all the VeggieTales episodes from the Warner era, I gotta say, I think my top two have to be Bavel Joe and Star of Christmas. Yeah. Those are like my, my two favorite VeggieTales episodes from the Warner era. So anyways, um I gotta say the songs in this in this episode are are pretty good. Like I love the Oh Little Joe song or whatever. That one whatever that song's supposed to be called. And I don't know, of course I love the belly button song from Boys in the Sink. That one's definitely definitely a well known well known song in the fandom, for sure. <laughs> So anyways, overall, I recommend you pick up The Battle of Old Joe. Definitely a really, really great episode to watch, for sure. Anyways, that's going to do it for me, everybody. And the next episode will be on an Easter Carol, so please stay tuned. See you all next time. Bye.